prophesy unto these bones and say unto them, O ye dry bones, hear the word of the Lord. Thus saith the Lord God unto these bones, Behold, I will cause breath to enter into you, and ye shall live. And and I will say, I will, and I will lay sinews in you, upon you, and will bring, and will bring upon, and bring up flesh upon you, and cover you with skin, and put breath into you, in you, and he shall live, and he shall know that I am the Lord. So I prophesied as the Lord commanded, as and as I prophesied, there was a noise, and behold, a shaking, and the bones came together, bones to his bones. And when I beheld the low sinews and the flesh came upon them, and the skin covered them above, there but there was no breath in them. Then said he unto me, Prophesy to the wind, prophesy, son of man, and say to the wind, Thus said the Lord God, Come from the four winds, O breath, and breathe upon these slain, that they may live. So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived, and they stood up unto their feet, an exceedingly great army. Then he said unto me, Son of man, these bones are the whole house of Israel. Behold, they say, our bones are dried and our hope is lost. We are cut off for our parts. Therefore, prophesy and say unto them, Thus saith the Lord God, Behold, O my people, I will open your graves and cause you to come out of your graves and bring you into the land of Israel. And he shall know that I am the Lord when I have opened your graves, O my people, and brought you up out of your graves. Fourteen and last, and I shall put my spirit in you, and he shall live, and I shall place you in your own land. Then shall he know that I, the Lord, have spoken it and performed it, say the Lord. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Heavenly Father, we come before you right now, God Almighty. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for this hour. We thank you, God Almighty, for this day that you have called into being before we were even formed in our mother's womb. Lord God Almighty, you have placed a call upon our lives. You have ordained, Lord God Almighty, and planned, God Almighty, that we will be in your presence today. Right now, God Almighty, I plead the blood in the atmosphere. I come against every plan of the enemy right now. I declare clear Lord Jesus that your words will come forth with clarity God Almighty in the name of Jesus oh God Almighty we thank you Lord Jesus and we declare God Almighty that it's already done in this season Lord Jesus we plead the blood in Granville today Lord Jesus we declare revival in this community Lord Jesus we come against every plan of the enemy right now we tear them down in the name of Jesus Satan, the blood of Jesus is against you. We bind the strong man of this community. Lord Jesus, we bind every prince, demon, and devil that has been assigned from hell to torment this city, God Almighty, this community. But we tear it down. We plead the blood this morning in this place one more time. Lord Jesus Christ, Almighty God, and we declare it done in the spirit realm. God Almighty, we declare it, Lord Jesus, that this this is a revival season. We come against generational curses. We come against generational sickness. God Almighty, I speak life over your people today. Lord Jesus, you know every one of our situation. God Almighty, you know, Lord Jesus, that as our face differ, so our situation. And mighty God of Daniel, we pull down every trouble. We plead the blood. The blood, the blood, the blood, the blood. We declare that it's revival time. We declare that it's breakthrough time. God Almighty, we declare that every shackles, every knock, every fetter has been broken now in the spirit realm. I step into my authority and say, God, I'm buying you with the blood. I'm buying you with the blood. Shut up, I'm a higher. Hey, the blood, the blood, the blood, the blood, the blood. 
to get frustrated so that our expectancy spirit or the spirit of expectancy is shattered mm. Ah, he knows that it's with our mind that we serve God and he comes with some cunning little things some cunning little situation to get us frustrated all in the name of getting us frustrated but right now Oh, I come against, hallelujah, every dart, hallelujah, every negative mindset, every wounded, broken spirit, I break it now upon the authority of the Holy Ghost. I declare that it's revival time, it's revival season, it's your winning season, it's your breakthrough hour, everything that you have desired, he said, ask what you will. Seek and you shall find. Now is your winning season. If you believe that it's your winning season, open the mouth of yours and claim it. Declare it in the atmosphere. Hallelujah. Hey, God Almighty. For some it might be fear. Ah, but come on, you have to open that mouth and declare today that I'm no longer a slave to fear anymore because my daddy says 
situation and when I got up and I was saying Lord what does this mean he said to me the spirit of hostage mm. come on we are gonna break some things that the devil has held hostage for us there's some things that God has determined for your family that I know you can't see it your work paycheck to paycheck and it can't come to pass that's not of God. Lord Jesus, he said that nothing good will he withhold. 